This is the procedure on how to change the access uh, pin length on the Kaba E and P Series 2000. Uh, by default, the lock is set to accept four digit user pins, but if a user wants to use a longer pin length, uh, you can change that setting in the lock. It does have to be done while the lock is in factory mode. A quick way to verify that the lock is in factory mode is that the uh, master pin is set to the factory default of one through eight, which this lock is. So the command to change the user pin length is uh, 009, and then you would designate anything from four to eight digit uh, user uh, length, which is done with either 0405 and so on. So you're gonna start the programming procedure of the lock by pressing pound. You enter the existing master code, which again, that's the factory default of one through eight right now. The command 009 says we wanna change the user length and we're gonna change it from uh, 04 to 06, let's say. We press pound and that changes uh, the setting from four to six digit pins. Now, the next step would have to be to put the lock uh, into programming mode you first have to change the master pin from one through eight by pressing pound one through eight, zero, 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 pound. You're gonna enter any eight digit master code you want other than one through eight. And for my demo, I typically use eight through one. You hit pound, you enter it a second time to confirm, and you press pound twice. And you'll see now that eight through one is in fact a new master code. You do want to use a, a uh, number that is not common because that code will open the door. But now that the master code has been changed, we can add a user pin. And again, we are now using six digit user pins. So the procedure to enter a user pin, you got to put the lock in the programming mode by pressing pound, entering the existing master code of eight through one. Pound, the command one zero zero means I want to add a user. This is going to be user 001, and my six-digit pin will just use one, two, three, four, five, six. I enter it a second time after pressing pound to confirm, and a second pound ends the session. And now you can see that one by powering the lock up, one through six is a new pin in the lock.